Hey guys, Lord of Fear, and welcome back to the Forza Mars Verse 6. Now it's Chris Banshee back DLC, part number 32 of this playthrough. We're trying on Homestead again. Last part, I got through, uh, I don't know what track it was, I can't remember, but we got through there, and I think, yeah, it was the Circuit of the Americas West version, so, and then we went here and did terrible. So what I did, um, I changed the uh, difficulty to Pro instead of Unbeatable, because Pro, at, or because Unbeatable at, with, at this track, they just go full throttle and they're like a second faster than me, so in order to actually advance this, we gotta slow, uh, lower down the Pro, which I think is the third time I've done this this entire playthrough, I believe, so there you, I showed you that, and here's the, uh, the assist, same as always, mods, we're gonna leave it as is, and uh, let's just uh, see how this plays out i'm looking forward to it because i think we can advance in one go but you never know with this game because it throws me curveball every single freaking part three two one green flags out run away here at home so we got 10 laps of this and let's just uh see oh my god harley Quinn. okay she's kind of like moved to the left there but you move up into p8 and uh see the leaders right up in front of me i don't know if this will be super easy or very hard i don't know but we got, we have developed since the last time we're here, and oh my god, Kenseth. Again, a Gibbs car has to it, it try to do something. It faked me out there, but that was just, just shady on his part. But we're in third right now in the advanced spot. I think Casey Kane just nipped the outside wall. We're right there with second and first, getting the draft, starting to get that weird tunnel vision. And just stay to the inside. The, the custom 11 car just stopped. I don't know what that was for. I guess he was scared. I think, no, okay, I was going to say we clear Kane, but no, he gets a very good run off of two and takes the lead back. Can we clear Kane? I would like that. That would be nice to get a free win, but we're, oh, <laughs> he hit the outside wall. That's, um, hmm. Anyways, we get the lead, finally, and there's a random car stopping, trying to do his best LePage impression, but we get the lead, and let's just uh, pull away from here on out. Starting lap six, the Casey Kane is right behind me still. I kind of messed up turns three and four just a little bit. I just nipped the apron, and it was enough to slow me down for Kane to kind of catch me there. But um, looks like he kind of hit the brakes or something because he lost a lot of ground on me. But yeah, as you saw, there was like a random car stopped uh, on the lower side of the track. I don't know why, but uh, the AIs at ovals are very, very wonky in terms of just performance and derpness. White flags out one more time around the racetrack. I'm still pulling away from Kane, who I think is getting caught in some lap traffic behind me. See that little gap in between me and Kane is Kyle Busch in the middle. Basically, since I got the lead, uh, Kane challenged me for the most part, but starting to pull away from him because of lap cars, so that's you know always fine. And, um, and we're gonna advance, so that's you know it's it's beautiful. You know it's very nice to to win in this freaking series because it doesn't happen very often or very rarely or seldomly occurs but we're going to come across the line and win that race and that was some good shit so thank you for something one, one more race down and then we can this this will get us closer to finishing this freaking let's play next race is at road atlanta i'm familiar with this track but obviously I haven't practiced because i'm i was practicing this trying to figure out you know uh, you know wh how to approach the freaking AIs being stupid and derping on stars, but it's, it's a science at this point. We only have 18 cars, I guess, on the lead lap. Interesting. Uh, it seemed like we had maybe the fastest uh, car. It uh, it very well looked like it. So um, yeah, that's uh, that's good for once. So yeah, all right, let's uh, move on to Road Atlanta and probably fail like 30 times. All right, let's go to driver to heart difficulty. Put that back up to unbeatable, and has to save that. Does it have to load the whole game again? That's um, that's a little bit annoying. I don't know why it has to load to save that. Whatever. Assists. Uh, been the same for multiple parts. Just want to show you. And mods. We're just gonna leave it as is and hope for the best. So. All right, I'm expecting to do horrible, so this will be literally a dry run. <laughs> so you get to see how bad I am if I don't practice. Three, two, one. Green flag is out underway here. We got six laps of this, so it must not be a super long track. Oh, Edwards, okay. okay move to the left there. 
start slowing down. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, well, already, we can't even get through turn one. And even if I didn't get through turn one, well, I was gonna get off the track because of the fucking AI driver just throwing his fucking car in there like an idiot, so. You know, I always look forward to that, you know, it just, you know. It, it makes going to sleep a lot easier because I'll be so freaking pissed off and tired. And I don't know what's going on in front of me there, but something happened. We're in 20th. I'm not too worried about that. I just want to kind of see, uh, oh, baby Jesus. Okay. 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 Oh, um, okay. Thank you. You know what? Um, I'm not going to advance, so I might as well just die. Can I flip? Yeah, we can flip it all right, Talladega style, and we're on our side. Never mind. Ooh, look at that. Da that damage model is better than NASCAR Heat Evolution will ever have. Let's please try to get the turn one. That that's like, I mean, it didn't happen at all that time, and I feel like they're just gonna stop, and it kind of did. Can't really go anywhere. Oh my god, it gave me a I mean, that's really my fault. Cause I'm a piece of shit. Okay, all right, we got through that corner. Oh my. god. God, they're all stopping. Oh, yeah, there's a corner there. Oh, my God, Kent's got it me. I'm oh, sorry, Brad, turn. Oh, God, I used to as a wall. Oh, my God, I got more damage, and now I'm bouncing in the tires. And, of course, the Gibbs car has to get into me somehow, and now we got a big fucking Bukaki of fuck Tartary back there. All right. Let's try that again. Okay, let's try to get to the inside this time, because it seems like being on the outside on, this, on that first corner is... Uh, absolutely uh, not the ideal thing to do. Oh my god, I got in the back of that 11 car. Just get away from them. Just get the hell away from them. Okay. Can I please... I like, I like to know, like, and anticipate, like, how to, you know, race this track or, you know, get familiarized with it and know my braking zones and the inner inner workings of this track's species. And it would be nice if, you know, you know, Kane didn't stop there. But, okay. okay can we at least be in, uh, in some clean air-ish, so I can actually figure out how to approach this damn track. Please? Okay, it seems like uh, we're gonna be in okay zone for a little bit. Oh my god! I nipped the grass just a tiny bit there, murdered the cone, fly it into the uh, tires, and Brad did the same thing, so he must be taking notes from me. But, uh, that was, uh, virtually one lap around here, and that was, uh, very scary. But we're still in six. We're right there with fifth, and I can see fourth up the road. So I can maybe cheek in a way of a top three somehow if I'm lucky. Get through that corner pretty damn well, actually. And now we secure fifth spot, and now our sight's on Brad for fourth. As he goes off track and slams in the tire barrier. All right. Well, we didn't do anything to get that spot, but we got second. Or fourth. I'm sorry. I'm getting confused. I'm thinking too far ahead right now. Overdrove the corner. Overdrove the corner. Really just... That's fantastic. Well... Alright, you know, just going 30 miles an hour and the car acts like it's fucking going 130. At least, thank you. Well... Yeah, uh, we're gonna get... It's over. It's game over. Alright, well, time to flip again. We Bam! Oh my god. Oh my god. Please, there we go. Thank you, car. All right. Still better wreck physics than NASCAR. <laughs> I think if we execute all these corners appropriately here, this uh, maybe we can actually advance. I mean, that's I know that's a, that's a very crazy thought. Oh my god! God damn! It's ridiculous how slow they go in that fucking corner. But it's all my fault. I'm a piece of shit. I know every part. I get. Oh my god! You know what? Get, get out of my way. <laughs> just just go. God damn, it's ridiculous. Alright, please just get through these couple of corners fine. I don't want my front end getting absolutely mauled to death. And Kenseth, custom car gets turned, now another car slows down, and our custom 24 is there, and we're into P6. Again, we didn't do a whole lot, it's mainly just them being stupid, but we get into 6th position. That was a, actually a very good corner exit there, and we're gonna pass Kane for fifth. I could see fourth and third right up the road. Can we get to them? I don't think so. 
In that corner, I swear to God, every time I go through there, I almost fuck it up, and that time I finally did. And I got in the king because I came down on him because I'm a piece of shit. And, uh, we're still sliding sideways. And we're now back to sixth. Now almost seventh, so that's, that's lovely. And all of that progress was made, but then one mistake, and it screwed me. But I hate this. That was, again, a very good corner exit by me. I'm proud of that. Only a few laps left to go, though, but I don't know if we can get to, you know, third, but... Uh, this is this is some good warm-up to practice for the, the next uh, part, where I'm probably going to have to practice, like, two more days and figure out how to be a master here. A little bit cheeky there, getting that spot, but we managed to do it, and the... 30 car kind of drives me off the track. Oh my god, did I get through that corner just fine? No, I didn't. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. Oh my god. Get off, get off the grass. Thank you. Jesus. Get off the grass still. That's what I get for being just a teeny weeny bit aggressive. I'm never gonna finish this fucking playthrough. Kill me. Look at look at that. Our lap time was actually pretty, pretty damn good. I just think we need to have a good start. And I think we had a decent start and gained more spots. Then I think we probably could have won that race. I don't know, but start, the starts to the race are so damn important because like people derp and you have to anticipate the derps. I'll see you next part. We'll have to probably you know practice another day or two to figure out to be a master at this track. So. Hope you enjoyed my suffering because um, I'm dying inside. <laughs> Have a good day, everyone.